Hello friends, this is teacher JB. Let us start English. Today we are going to study 20 words uh, with the story Joe's Pond. Joe's Pond. The first word we are going to study is associate. Associate. Associate has four syllables A S S O C I. A T E. Actually, on the second level, and this all sounds like O. Also, and then there are two S's, and first S is cancelled. Associate. Associate. Associate means to connect something with a person or thing. To connect something with a person or thing. Most people associate birthday parties with having fun. One more time, most people associate birthday parties with having fun. Next one, environment. Environment has four syllables, E-N, V-I, R-O-N, M-E-N-T. And next on the second syllable, envi, environment, environment, and then M-E-N is nominal nominal suffix which means if you put m-e-n-t the word becomes a noun so that's why it is a noun the environment is the place where people work or live environment keeping our environment clean is important to our health keeping our environment environment clean is important to our health Next word, factory. Factory has three syllables, F A C T O R Y. Actually, the first syllable, fact. Factory. Factory is a noun. A factory is a building where things are made or put together. We have only one factory in our town. Factory. Next one, feature. Feature has two syllables, F-E-A-T-U-R-E, feature, feature, feature is a noun. A feature is an important part of something. The cell phone has many features, feature. Next word, instance. Instance has two syllables, I-N-S-T-A-N-C-E, Except on the first syllable, instance, instance. Instance is a noun. It means an example. Example. But there is another instance. I-N-S-T-A-N-C-E. And the adjective, instant. Okay. Instant, maybe you know, instant ramen. Instance, right away. And there's another instance, which means an example of something. I have never experienced an instance of hate. Have you? Next one, involve. Involve has two syllables. Involve, except in the second syllable, it's a verb. To involve means to be actively taking part in something. Involve. The whole family was involved in playing the game. Involve. Next one, Matt Eason. Madison has three syllables, M E D I C I N E. Actually, on the first syllable, Madison. Madison is a noun. Medicine is something you take to feel better or treat an illness. The doctor gave me medicine for my cold. Next one, mix. Mix. Is a noun. A mix is different things put together. The green mix we made in a science class spilled onto the table. Mix. Next one, organize. Organize has three syllables. O R G A N I Z E. Actually, the first syllable, organize. Organize. 
organizes a verb. To organize is to plan or get ready for an event. Make a list to help you organize the things you need. Make a list to help you organize the things you need. Next one, period. Period has three syllables, P-E-R, I, O, D, except in the first syllable, peer, peer, E, A, period, period is a noun. A period is an amount of time when something happens. In, our, in one period in Europe, there were many nights. Okay, this K is silent, night. In one period in Europe, there were many nights. Next one, populate. Populate has three syllables. P-O, actually the first syllable, it sounds pa pio Populate. Populate is a verb. And the noun is population. P-U-P-U-L-A-T-I-O-N. If people populate an area, they live there. Billions of people populate the earth. Okay. The next one, produce. Produce has two syllables, P-R-O-D-U-C-E, accent in the second syllable, produce. Produce is a verb. To produce something is to make or grow it. This tree produces apples every year. Produce. Produce. Next one, range. Range is a noun. A range is a number or a set of similar things. I saw a range of cars to choose from. Range. The next one, recognize. Recognize has three syllables. R-E-C, O-G, N-I-Z-E. Excellent, the first syllable, rec. Recognize. Recognize is a verb. To recognize something is to know to know it because you have seen it before. I recognized an old friend from many years ago. Recognize. Next one, regular. Regular has three syllables. R-E-G, accent of the first syllable. Reg. Reg. Yo. Regular. L-A-R. Regular is an adjective. If something is regular, it happens often and in equal amounts of time. Regular. A regular lunchtime is around noon. Regular. Regular. Next one, sign. Sign is a noun. A sign is a notice giving information, directions, and warning, etc. The sign indicated that today would be a bad day. Sign. Sign. The next word is tip, and tip is a noun. A tip is a pointed end of something. So this is called a fountain pen. Fountain pen. I don't think many people use fountain pens nowadays. Anyway, the tip of his pen was very sharp. The tip of his, uh, his pen was very sharp. Next one, tradition. Tradition has three syllables. T-R-A, tra, dish. And then actually I-O-N. And because of this sound, it sounds like shh. And here, tradition, tradition actually on the uh, third, second syllable, tradition is a noun. A tradition is something people have been doing for a long time. Marriage is a tradition all over the world. Tradition. And next one, trash. Trash. And when you have T before R, it sounds like ch. ch. So you read this word, trash. Trash. Trash is a noun. Trash is waste material or unwanted or worthless things. Please take out the trash. It smells bad. Trash. And the last word for today is white. White is an adjective. If something is white, it is large from side to side. From this side to this side. White. 
The door was as wide as my arms. The door was as wide as my arms. Wide. Now choose the right word for the given definition. To remember someone or something because you saw the person or saw the thing before, so it's going to be recognized. To remember someone or something is recognized. The sharp end of a stick. The sharp end of a stick is a tip. Large from side to side. So if this is from bottom to uh, from a uh, bottom to high top, it's going to be high. And then side to side, it's going to be wide. So answer is A, wide. To be an important part of something, to be an important part of something is involved. Involved, the last one, to make or create. To make or create is to produce something. Okay. Fill in the blanks with the correct words from the word bank. We have produce, sign, populate, period, and range. Large companies can many products, can make many products. So produce, produce, produce. I offered her a blank of choices from one to 10. So from one to 10, it's a range. So a range, I offered her a range of choices from one to 10. How many people blank this area? In this area, people live, populate, P-O-P-U-L-A-T-E. How many people populate this area? And give me a blank if you need a help. Okay, give me, you need a help. So maybe it's gonna be a sign. Give me a sign. Give me a sign if you need help. This blank will last for one hour. What? What will last for one hour? Okay, so the period. It's a, it's a one hour period. So this period will last for one hour. Okay, now check the sentence with bolded word that makes better sense. When you mix things, you take them somewhere. They make toys in toy factory. So uh, B is correct. A feature of this computer is its small size. We populate over the ocean. So answer is going to be A. A feature of this computer is its small size. It's just small and then maybe people like it. Number three, we put the trash outside so it could have taken could could be taken away. We ate chicken once so now it is a tradition you don't make a tradition by doing once so right answer is a we put trash outside so it could be taken away number four he went to the tip of the school doing a book report involves reading so you need to read in order to do a book report so b is answer the garbage truck came and produced some sunshine, it doesn't make sense. I associate dogs with good pet. So when whenever you think of a dog, you think about good pet. So B is the answer. You recognize someone whom you have already met. Blue is a range of color. Blue is only one color, it's not a range. So you recognize someone whom you uh, have already met. So A is correct. The sign was open all evening. I have a regular schedule. It doesn't change. So if it doesn't change, it's regular. So B is correct. Number eight, the tree is very wide because it is small. Tree is usually high, correct? Don't forget to organize a meeting for next uh, for next week. So B is correct. The clothing store had a sale on medicine. Clothing store doesn't have sale on medicine. Our environment has many plants and animals. Yes, B is the answer. The last one, an instance of kindness is sharing food. It sounds good. He had no period of work. Okay, so A is correct. An instance, 
An example of kindness is sharing food. Okay. Now let us read a story based on the word you have studied. The title is Joe's Pond. Joe made the world a better place. He got the idea to do that at school. He watched a video there. It was about a factory. This factory produced a lot of trash and put it in a river. The trash and water were a bad mix. People populated the area by the river and drank its water. This made them sick. Many of them needed medicine and made regular visits to doctors. But the video wasn't all bad news. It showed ways to pick up trash and why it's important to do this. It said people can make a difference to their environment. The video's important features made Joe associate trash with hurting people. One day, Joe walked through a park. He recognized some of the problems from the video. One instance of these problems was the trash in the pond. It was full of plastic cups. There was too much trash. Joe didn't want it to hurt anyone. He told his grandfather about the park. His grandfather said, you know, it's a tradition in our family to help people. That's why we give food to poor people. Maybe you can help people by cleaning the uh, park. Cleaning the park would involve hard work. Joe decided to organize a group to help him. He chose a wide area of the park. It had the most trash. He asked his family and friends to come. On Saturday, he gave everyone a sharp stick. They wondered why. He said, you use the stick tip to pick up trash. This makes it easier. They worked for six hours. Weeks. Different people helped each, each time, but Joe was always there. In that period of time, Joe saw a range of results. There was no trash in the water. People could swim in it. Joe knew that was a good sign. He was happy because he helped his environment. Okay, friends, this is the conclusion of today's study. I will come back to you with another 20 words as soon as possible. Until then, keep studying English and have a great day. Bye.